I started using Final Cut Pro 10 on the day it was released, and I did the thing everybody did, is open it up, go, oh my God, and shut it back down again. Oh God, what is this? What the hell? This can be really cool, and I really hate it. I could go from here to here and be okay, and from here to here and be okay, and then from seven to Final Cut 10, I'm like, why don't I understand this? Apple didn't help themselves by saying, we're no longer supporting Final Cut 7. We're doing a hard cut from Final Cut 7 to Final Cut 10, and they probably should have done a dissolve. I remember it coming out and there being this big kerfuffle. It actually had turned into good press for me because they've done something so huge here that it's pissing a lot of people off, so I'm automatically interested. Here was a group of people that were willing to take risks on pretty much every level and essentially start over after they had really conquered quite a bit of territory. I love that they said, let's reinvent. Let's look at where things are going with digital media and let's reinvent the editing paradigm based on where we think things are going. And in doing so, clearly they had left certain features behind and I think that people really focused on that. People should have been paying attention, but for some reason, a whole lot of people got really emotional and didn't look back, which is a big shame. I'm sad that people hate Final Cut 10, and I'm sad that the people who love Final Cut 10 feel like they're oppressed. I just want us all to get over it. I think they found it personally threatening because they didn't actually know what they were. And if you're a storyteller, it doesn't matter what kind of software you use. The skill of storytelling using video is becoming something that everybody needs to be able to do. That's what Final Cut 10 makes possible. It's a tool that we can use today to tell the stories that need to be told to enable our society to move forward. Every human being has got at least one beautiful story in their soul, and it would be nice to give them the strength and the ability to express it. We have that now with Final Cut 10. Today, you have very little excuse not to make a film if you really want to make a film. The mechanics of editing have kind of gone away, and it really now comes down to storytelling. Making it easier for somebody to tell a story means that we get to see more of those stories, which I think is really cool.